Hi, I'm Sonia and welcome to my channel, Life Over 60. In today's video, we're going to be talking about another new to me skincare ingredient called snail mucin. Before I get into the video and talk about this uh, particular ingredient, just a word of warning that this is not vegan. So if you are a vegan, then this video may not be of interest to you. What is snail mucin? Well, essentially, it's something that snails excrete. And they typically excrete a slimy substance for two reasons. One, when they're kind of walking over, you know, bumpy surfaces, it's, it, it acts as a protectant to the snail. And then the other time is if they're put under stress, they will excrete a slimy substance. And this is called... Um, snail secretion filtrate and that is the product that is used in cosmetics. The extraction process I think differs from company to company. I purchased a product from Cosrx and this particular company says that their product is cruelty free. They don't do any uh, testing on animals and they also say that there are no external stressors placed on the snails and essentially what they do is they take the snails and they put them into like put them on top of a mesh covered netting and it's it's dark and it and they allow the snails to roam freely uh for about 30 minutes or so and what that does apparently is gets the snails to extract the the mucin and then they're put back into their other environment Research also shows that the quality of mucin is much higher if the snails are kept in good environmental conditions. And as I mentioned with Cosrx, they, as I said, they say they don't put any external stressors on, on the snails. So how did we come to find out about snail mucin that the excretion from a snail is good for us or has some beneficial health um, benefits for, for our skin. Well, it's been around for a long time. Back in like 400 BC, Hippocrates apparently used it and it was used to, you know, for, for wound healing, to treat scars. And throughout the centuries, you know, you can go back and, and see that the snail mucin was used uh, for, uh, you know, redness in the skin, irritation of the skin to help, you know, calm the skin, uh, to treat wounds for acne. So it's been around for a long, long time, but it's only became popular probably starting around in the 1960s from, from what I can tell. And that was when Chilean snail farmers who were, uh, you know, farming the snails for export over to France, export over to France, they noticed that their hands were really soft and young looking. And, you know, and that was from the, the, the slime, I guess, getting onto their skin. And, you know, how it went from that to becoming you know, this hugely popular cosmetic ingredient. Well, I think it was just some enterprising cosmetic companies heard about it, saw this and started using it in their products. And it's at the beginning, you know, it was very, very popular in South America and or in Asia, but now it's even becoming popular in the US. Um, and it's, a, it's something that's really gained a lot of popularity and, and, I think it's something like over a $400 million industry, if not more today. So what then are the benefits? And even, like I say, even though there, there hasn't been a lot of research on these products, there have been some studies that are showing that there are benefits. And as I said, it's been around for centuries and showing, showing to be of, of use for certain you know, skin issues and ailments. 
So the benefits uh, apparently are many for this product. One is, well, I, I guess overall it's an anti-aging super serum, you might say, because it has something called allantoin, which calms irritating um, uh, skin and helps with skin re uh, regeneration. It's got glycolic acid, uh, which is great for breaking down the bonds between the dead skin cells and the top layer of skin, and so therefore it helps prevent clogged pores and dullness in the skin. It's also got hyaluronic acid, which is a very powerful humectant that keeps the skin moisture content, um, or that maintains the skin moisture content and, you know, kind of plumps out the, those fine lines and wrinkles. It has elastin, uh, which, you know, as we get older, we start to lose the elastin in our skin. And by having something with elastin, it can maybe help bring back some of that firmness back into our skin. It's got collagen, which again, uh, you know, really does help with um, your skin volume, your skin structure. And again, losing collagen is something that happens to us as we age. So if we can get back some of that collagen, that is really, really beneficial. It also has uh, vitamins like zinc, which is an anti-inflammatory, uh, mang manganese, which is a healing, vitamins A and E, which are antioxidants, so it has many, many benefits. Now, what does it look like? Well, let me show you. It's quite, um, this is uh, the Cosrx uh, snail mucin, and it's, you can see, like it's very thick gel-like substance. It has no, no smell to it. And like, it just really abs absorbs super nicely into your skin, like, and I've been using this product now for, oh, two or three weeks, I guess. And I really noticed that when my skin gets irritated, which it sometimes does when I use my tretinoin, you know, I'll start to get some redness and some flakiness, flaking of the skin, which is, which is common when you use tretinoin. But then when I use this, usually like in the morning, I really feel that the dryness and the redness is, is reduced. Uh, and the flakiness of my skin is reduced. So, so, so far, like I'm liking this product. It's interesting product, um, snail stuff. I mean, it's not, you know, it goes through a lot of processes, I think, to make sure that it's safe for the consumer and, and all of that. But nonetheless, I think it's quite an interesting uh, product. I hope you enjoyed this little video. And uh, if you did, I'd love it if you gave it a thumbs up. And if you want to see other videos that I'm putting out, well, just hit that notification button and you'll know when I release a new video. Until the next time, enjoy your day and we'll see you soon.